pretty high. This is Sean Hogan, Director of Instruction at the Ledbetter Academy. We've got player number three here of the four players that I'm critiquing for you. Now, with this particular player, if you look at his build, we've got Ernie Els on the right-hand side. And what will help this player a lot is his setup position. You can see he's got very long arms. Okay? You can see his hands are very close to his knees here. So we want a golf swing that is functional and makes it easy for him to be consistent so he can have a more solid contact on a more consistent basis. So he has to get a little a little bit better here at his setup. So number one, uh, at address, a couple of things at address that I would do. I would certainly move the ball position more forward and take out some of that excessive forward lean. So that's number one. You can see Ernie's ball position forward of center slightly and not as much forward lean. So that's the number one first point at address. Always improve the setup and that will help improve the swing and the contact. Okay, it's the easiest and quickest way to get better by getting a more solid setup. So in this cares, player's case, excuse me, we're going to get the ball position a little bit more forward and then have less forward lean, have the shaft more straight up and down. That's number one. Okay. Number two with this player, okay, number two with this player, we want to see a backswing, okay, that's a little bit shorter, okay, and wider. So you can see here with Ernie Els, you can see the backswing is shorter and wider this way. You can see this player's backswing is too long, especially as, as he already has long arms. You don't want him to have a long overswing with his arms here. So his backswing's a little bit too long, and we want to see a shorter backswing. So we want him to feel, okay, like Ernie here. Okay, you can see his hands are here, and his head is here. So we want a wider, shorter backswing. So if we put his head here, we want him to feel from the face-on position, that his hands are more over here. Okay? So set up. All right, number one, at address. We want the ball position more forward and the hands more straight up and down. That's number one. Number two, we want a shorter backswing with his hands, arms, and club. So we want him to feel like his hands are wider and further away from his right shoulder like Ernie. And then number three, if we go to the down the line view, okay, you can see how long these arms are. He's got very long arms, so we've got to match his swing to his build a little better. Okay, let's go ahead and bring him up here. So overall, very good posture. He's doing well there. Okay. So here we're going to feel a little bit more, we're going to, add a, as he starts the club back, we're going to get a little bit more rotation in the club face. So you can see the club face is very closed. So we want to rotate the club face a little bit more and get it into a wider position. Okay, you can see Ernie's club face there, a little bit more toe up, not so closed. So we want him to rotate the club face into a wide position as opposed to shutting it and taking it into a long, narrow position. All right, you can see his right arm has gone behind him there. All right, so we want a wider position with a more neutral face position like Ernie. Okay, so let's summarize here. Okay, posture. Okay, here we go with the iron. Let's just magnify it out. So posture number one. A little, little less forward lean on the shaft. So we're going to get the shaft more straight up and down. Number two, we want a wider position at the top. So we want him to feel like his hands 
and arms as hands from the center of the chest stay more to his right okay so we don't want it here this is where we don't want it we actually want it if I rewind a little bit all right we want to see his arms more let's see right there that would be nice to see a shorter arm swing all right and then to help out with the face position because you can see the face position there is very closed we're going to have a little bit more rotation as he starts back okay so you can see here as we look down the line we're going to have a little bit more rotation in the face instead of keeping it shut so more of a toe up feel to a wide backswing feel okay so posture ball position more forward hands less forward leaned okay not so close there with the face so more toe up to a wider shorter arm swing all right hope this helps take care bye bye